At this time, Command Sergeant Major Costin steps forward and presents the organizational colors to Colonel Rowling. The passing of the colors from the outgoing commander to the senior tactical commander signifies that the unit is never without officer leadership. Colonel Rowling passes the colors to Major General Longo. The passing of the colors from the senior tactical commander to the incoming commander signifies the passing of his trust and also the responsibility for the unit and its soldiers. By authority of paragraph 2-3, Army Regulation 600-20, the undersigned assumes command of the 173rd Infantry Brigade Combat Team Airborne, signed 27 June 2013. Colonel Michael L. Foster, Infantry Commanding. Andy did not want me to talk about the largest airborne operation since this brigade jumped into Iraq in 2003. Nor did he want to talk about three CTC rotations, nor did he want me to talk about commanders in Afghanistan actually fighting to get this brigade into their regional command because of its reputation for discipline. While these soldiers were operating in Afghanistan, I happened to be one of the seemingly thousands of generals up at ISAF headquarters in Kabul. Sitting through probably 700 meetings in my year there, not once, not a single time, did I hear anyone question what was going on in Logar or Wardak provinces with the 173rd. The most senior leaders in Afghanistan consistently expressed their confidence that this exceptionally disciplined brigade would understand the nuance of when to put the Afghans in the lead and when to, say, maybe take a more direct approach. And great soldiers followed the lead of their commander. And Andy was the absolute right man at the right time. We've run the hills of Barrico. We've jumped in the Pisa, in the Aviano. We might have ridden our bikes to Asiago, had a couple cappuccinos. We trained at Graf. We've been there for the hard times, the memorial services, family trouble, soldier trouble, personal stress, sometimes just life. We've welcomed new soldiers into the brigade as they drop their bags from the bus from the airport, and we've been there when they died on ba in battle. Thankfully, the goodness has always outweighed the bad. It's part of what makes this brigade so special. So as we leave here today, the memories will be fond, even if the emotions are mixed. To the paratroopers of the 173rd, I am familiar with your lineage and proud history, as well as your recent accomplishments and achievements. Reggie and I are thrilled to be a part of this team, and I am truly honored and humbled to stand in your ranks. I look forward to our time and to the challenges we will face and overcome together. Sky Soldiers.